so hello everyone welcome back now let us start problem number 3.32 which is on page number 158 so he says that we have two point charges 3q and minus q separated by distance a for each of the arrangements and we need to find monopole moment dipole moment and the approximate potential so first of all let us take uh, so first of all let us take part number a uh, which says which says that uh, the three q charge is in the z axis and it is at the center so monopole term for part a as we very well know that it is the sum of the charges so we get only 2q here the dipole term dipole term dipole moment or dipole uh, term it is given by p into the distance so p is uh, uh, the charge 3q and the distance from the center which is a and the direction is z cap upside now the approximate potential the potential here will be the potential due to monopole term plus potential due to dipole term so it is given by 2q upon 4 pi epsilon not r because the potential the formula is for the a point charges k q by r i hope you very well know that and the dipole term is uh, p cos theta in the last video i explained that so 3 q a cos theta upon 4 pi epsilon not r square so why p cos theta we, we write p cos theta because but the formula is uh, p dot r cap so but here p p is in the z cap direction so p dot uh, z cap dot r cap in the spherical polar coordinates will give us cos theta that's why we directly like that write this so now let us calculate for part b the monopole term again it is 2q the dipole moment term uh, it is p into the distance from the uh, uh, charge from the center so it is given by minus q a and the direction is minus z cap so it is q a z cap so the approximate potential formula is uh, 2 q a 4 pi epsilon not r plus q a cos theta upon 4 pi epsilon not r square so now coming to part c the monopole term here is again 2q the dipole moment term is p uh, it is given by 3 uh, 3a 3q a uh, in the direction of y cap now the now the trick here is or the matlab um, uh, or the thing that that we should look is uh, when we write the potential that is net potential or the approximate potential i should say it will be given by v moment uh, monopole term plus v dipole momentum and it will be 2q sorry 2q upon 4 pi epsilon not r plus but now the dipole moment term is in the y cap direction so we need to apply the standard formula or the general formula here which is p uh, dot r cap upon 4 pi epsilon not r square so on simplifying we get y cap and r cap as our dot product and it is given by sin theta sin phi i hope you know that y in spherical coordinates is r uh, r cap sin theta sin phi uh, r sin theta sin phi and all simplifying will will get this so 2 q a 4 2 q 4 pi epsilon not r plus what is my dipole moment 3 q a sin theta sin phi and in the 4 pi epsilon not r square so this is the approximate uh, potential for the this figure c part so uh, i hope you got the point of the problem that if if the uh, a dipole moment term is in other some other direction other than z cap then we need to apply the standard formula or you, uh, else you can apply the direct the cos theta formula easily so that's all for this video see you in next video bye bye thank you